Have you ever let your imagination wander to the farthest realms of possibility, where we, as humans, create our own sun? Welcome to the exciting world where imagination meets reality, a place where the impossible becomes possible and the dreams of today become the realities of tomorrow. Get ready to be amazed because we just achieved the impossible, creating an artificial sun through nuclear fusion. Our minds are powerhouses capable of conjuring up ideas that can change the world and one such idea that was once a figment of science fiction is the creation of an artificial sun. Yes, you heard it right. We're talking about a man-made sun, a celestial body of our own making. A star brought to life not in the vastness of space but right here on Earth in a controlled environment. This concept, as overwhelming as it may sound, has profound implications for the future of energy production and scientific advancement. Imagine harnessing the power of the sun, the very heart of our solar system, the beacon of light and heat that sustains life on our planet. Now imagine that power, that energy, under our control, ready to be tapped into and used for the betterment of humankind. But creating an artificial sun is no easy feat. It requires overcoming monumental challenges such as achieving extreme temperatures and containing plasma, the very lifeblood of a star. It demands the utmost precision, the most advanced technology, and an unwavering commitment to the pursuit of knowledge. The journey to creating an artificial sun, however, is not just about the destination. It's about the path that leads there, the research and technology that make it possible, the magnetic fields, plasma confinement, and so much more. It's a testament to human ingenuity, perseverance, and the relentless pursuit of progress. And guess what? We've done it. We've broken through the barriers, pushed past the boundaries of possibility, and created our very own artificial sun. This isn't just a leap forward for science, it's a giant leap for mankind. Today, we will explore how this revolutionary idea has become a reality. Hold on tight, because we're about to embark on a journey where imagination meets reality, and the impossible becomes possible. Welcome to the world of the artificial sun. Creating an artificial sun is no small task. It's a revolutionary concept that could alter the course of our future energy production. Imagine harnessing the power of the sun right here on Earth, a contained, controlled ball of plasma burning at millions of degrees, just like the heart of our solar system. This is the concept of an artificial sun, a man-made star. The idea is not just a fancy science fiction trope, it's a tangible, albeit challenging, scientific pursuit with the potential to revolutionize the way we generate and consume energy. The sun, after all, is the ultimate power source. It bombards our planet with more energy in one hour than the entire world uses in a year. If we can tap into even a fraction of that power, we could solve many of our energy problems. The concept of an artificial sun is rooted in nuclear fusion, the process that powers the sun and every other star in the universe. Unlike nuclear fission, which is what our current nuclear power plants use, fusion combines light elements like hydrogen into heavier ones, releasing enormous amounts of energy in the process. It's a clean, virtually unlimited source of power. The potential significance of an artificial sun cannot be overstated. It could provide us with a limitless, clean energy source drastically reducing our dependence on fossil fuels and significantly mitigating the effects of climate change. It could also further our understanding of the universe, allowing us to study stellar phenomena in a controlled environment. Moreover, the knowledge gleaned from creating an artificial sun could propel us forward in other fields, such as space travel. With a portable, miniature sun, we could power long-distance space missions, taking us to the farthest reaches of our solar system and beyond. But, as you might imagine, this task does not come without its challenges. Creating an artificial sun is not a walk in the park. It involves overcoming several significant challenges, including extreme temperatures and plasma containment. Imagine trying to replicate the conditions at the core of our sun, right here on Earth. A daunting task, isn't it? That's because the sun operates through nuclear fusion, a process that requires a blazing temperature of about 15 million degrees Celsius. That's hotter than the hottest lava on Earth, hotter than the surface of the sun, and even hotter than the interior of a lightning bolt. Now, to produce nuclear fusion in a lab, we need to crank up the heat even more to temperatures exceeding 100 million degrees Celsius. That's over six times hotter than the core of the sun, but the hurdles don't end with just hitting the right temperature. Once we've got the heat cranked up, 
we then need to deal with plasma, the fourth state of matter. When a gas is heated to extreme temperatures, its atoms break apart into a soup of charged particles, a state known as plasma. This plasma must be contained long enough for fusion to occur. But here's the catch. Plasma is so hot that it can't be held in any material container. If it touches the walls, it cools down and fusion stops. So, how do we contain something that can't be touched? The answer lies in the ingenious use of magnetic fields. Trapped within a donut-shaped vacuum chamber, the plasma is held in place by superconducting magnets, creating a magnetic bottle that prevents it from touching the walls. But this is no ordinary bottle. It's a dynamic, pulsating entity that requires constant tweaking to maintain the right shape and stability. The slightest miscalculation or deviation can cause the plasma to escape or cool down, halting the fusion process. The process of achieving nuclear fusion is akin to taming a wild dragon. It's a delicate dance, a balance between unleashing the power of the plasma and keeping it under control. It's a challenge that has baffled scientists for decades, a puzzle that has been likened to holding the sun in a bottle. But, as we all know, humanity is no stranger to overcoming hurdles. From the moon landing to decoding the human genome, we've proved time and again that we can conquer the impossible. And so after decades of research, countless trials and errors, and unwavering perseverance, we finally managed to overcome these hurdles. By harnessing the power of superconducting magnets and advanced plasma confinement techniques, we've successfully created an artificial sun in a controlled environment. A breakthrough that has turned science fiction into reality and opened up a whole new world of possibilities for renewable energy sources. However, with innovation and relentless determination, these challenges were met head on. So, let's continue this journey of discovery as we venture into the exciting world of nuclear fusion and the artificial sun. The creation of an artificial sun is not magic, but the result of innovative research and technology. The process begins with a concept that is as fascinating as it is complex, nuclear fusion. This is the same process that powers our sun, where atomic nuclei combine to form a heavier nucleus, releasing an immense amount of energy in the process. To replicate this process on Earth, we need to create conditions that are like those in the sun's core. This involves heating a gas to extreme temperatures, transforming it into a state of matter known as plasma. Plasma is a hot soup of free-moving particles, consisting of positively charged ions and negatively charged electrons. But creating plasma is just the first step. The challenge lies in confining this plasma long enough for nuclear fusion to occur while preventing it from touching the walls of the reactor. Why? Well, simply because at these extreme temperatures, any material known to man would instantly vaporize. This is where magnetic fields come into play. Magnetic fields are used to confine the plasma within a donut-shaped chamber known as a tokamak. This is essentially a magnetic bottle created using powerful electromagnets that keeps the superheated plasma suspended in mid-air, away from the walls of the reactor. However, the use of magnetic fields poses its own set of challenges. Plasma is notorious for its instability. It squirms, writhes, and tries to escape the magnetic bottle, creating a constant battle to maintain confinement. To overcome this, scientists have developed advanced techniques to control plasma. One such technique is the use of magnetic perturbations, small controlled distortions in the magnetic field that can effectively suppress the plasma's unruly behavior. But the technology behind an artificial sun goes beyond plasma confinement. An equally important aspect is heating the plasma to temperatures over 100 million degrees Celsius, far hotter than the core of the sun itself. To achieve this, scientists use a combination of methods, including ohmic heating, where an electric current is passed through the plasma, and radio frequency heating, where electromagnetic waves are used to heat the plasma. And let's not forget about fuel. The fuel for fusion reactions is a mixture of two isotopes of hydrogen, deuterium and tritium. Deuterium can be extracted from seawater, making it virtually limitless, while tritium can be produced within the reactor itself from lithium, another abundant element. The road to creating an artificial sun has been paved with countless innovations and tireless research. From the development of magnetic confinement techniques to the design of advanced heating systems and the selection of the right fuel, every aspect is a testament to human ingenuity and our relentless pursuit of knowledge. The fruit of all this labor is the successful creation of an artificial sun, a miniature star on Earth. 
capable of producing energy through nuclear fusion. It's the culmination of decades of research, a testament to human ingenuity, and a beacon of hope for a future powered by clean, limitless energy. This research led to a breakthrough that has forever changed the landscape of energy production. The creation of an artificial sun is no longer a distant dream, but a tangible reality, a shining example of how science and technology can transform our world. It's a story of triumph over adversity, a chronicle of human achievement, and a testament to our undying quest for knowledge and progress. So the next time you look up at the sun, remember, we have harnessed its power right here on Earth, turning science fiction into science fact. And who knows what other wonders the future may bring? As we continue to push the boundaries of what's possible, one thing is certain. The sky is no longer the limit. This research led to a breakthrough that has forever changed the landscape of energy production. The dawn of a new era in energy production has arrived thanks to a breakthrough in nuclear fusion. Imagine harnessing the power of the sun right here on Earth. This isn't just a figment of science fiction anymore, it's now a tangible reality. For decades, scientists have been trying to recreate the sun's energy. The sun, a natural nuclear reactor, releases energy by fusing hydrogen atoms to form helium. This process, known as nuclear fusion, has been the holy grail for scientists aiming to create a sustainable and clean source of energy. But as we mentioned earlier, creating an artificial sun is no walk in the park. It requires temperatures of over 100 million degrees Celsius, which is seven times hotter than the sun's core, to get atoms to collide and fuse together. Containing this scorching plasma has been another massive challenge. However, the impossible has been achieved. A team of scientists has successfully created an artificial sun in a controlled environment. This is a monumental milestone in the field of nuclear fusion. They've used a donut-shaped device known as a tokamak to confine the incredibly hot plasma using magnetic fields. The breakthrough came when they managed to sustain a fusion reaction for a significant period, creating a miniature sun that glowed with intense heat and light. This artificial sun didn't just flicker into existence and fade away, it was maintained for a substantial duration, marking a successful and controlled nuclear fusion. What's even more exciting is the technology used in achieving this feat. It involves the precise application of magnetic fields to contain the plasma and laser technology to heat it to the required temperatures. This intricate dance of advanced technology and scientific knowledge has brought us one step closer to a future powered by the stars. The creation of this artificial sun is a testament to human ingenuity and perseverance. It's a symbol of our relentless pursuit of knowledge and our ability to push boundaries in our quest for sustainable and clean energy sources. This breakthrough in nuclear fusion is not just about creating an artificial sun, it's about the dawn of a new era where energy is abundant, clean, and limitless. It's about a future where blackouts are a thing of the past and our energy demands are met without harming our planet. This achievement is more than just a scientific marvel. It holds the potential to solve our energy crisis. It signals a future where energy is not a commodity that is fought over, but a resource that is available to all. As we stand on the cusp of this new dawn, let's take a moment to marvel at the artificial sun that we've created. It's not just a glowing ball of plasma. It's a beacon of hope for a brighter, cleaner, and more sustainable future. This breakthrough in nuclear fusion and the creation of an artificial sun is not just an achievement, it's a beacon of hope for our energy future. Imagine a world where energy shortage is a thing of the past. With the successful creation of an artificial sun, we've unlocked the potential of harnessing energy the way nature intended. The sun, the colossal fusion reactor in the sky, has been powering life on Earth for billions of years. Now we're on the brink of replicating this process, bringing a piece of the sun right here on Earth. Why is this significant? Nuclear fusion is incredibly efficient. It produces four times the energy of nuclear fission, the process used in current nuclear power plants, and the fuel for fusion, hydrogen, is abundant and virtually inexhaustible. More importantly, nuclear fusion doesn't produce long-lived radioactive waste, making it a cleaner and safer alternative. But the journey is far from over. While we've made a significant leap, there's still a lot of work to be done. Creating a stable, self-sustaining fusion reaction is the next big challenge. We need to refine the technology and find ways to make it economically viable. But the promise it holds is too great to ignore. The creation of an artificial sun could revolutionize our energy infrastructure. It could lead to an era of abundant, cheap, and clean energy. 
it could help us combat climate change and secure a sustainable energy future. And it's not just about energy. The advancements in plasma physics, material science, and engineering could also lead to countless other innovations. It's a reminder that when we dare to dream big and work tirelessly towards our goals, we can achieve the impossible. Our journey into the realm of scientific discovery and innovation is far from over. This artificial sun is but a stepping stone in the vast ocean of scientific exploration. Each day we inch closer to the answers that have eluded us for centuries. Each day, the impossible becomes a little more possible. The creation of an artificial sun is a testament to human tenacity and ingenuity. It's a tale of perseverance, of countless trials and errors, of not giving up in the face of insurmountable challenges. It's a tale that reminds us that the line between the impossible and the possible is often just a matter of perspective. But as we stand on this precipice of a new era, let's not forget that the journey of discovery is not a sprint, but a marathon. It's a path paved with curiosity, with questions that lead to more questions, with the thrill of the unknown. And as we continue this journey, let's remember to always keep our minds open, our hearts curious, and our spirits undeterred. As we delve deeper into the world of nuclear fusion and renewable energy, let's not forget to marvel at the wonders of science, at the magic that happens when we dare to dream and dare to explore. Let's not forget to appreciate the beauty of the journey, the joy of discovery, and the thrill of innovation. Let's keep exploring, keep questioning, keep pushing the boundaries of what we know and what we can achieve. And remember, every step we take, every discovery we make, brings us one step closer to a brighter, more sustainable future. Today, we've delved into the revolutionary concept of an artificial sun. It's a concept that challenges our understanding of nature and pushes the boundaries of human innovation. We've examined the hurdles that had to be overcome to make this dream a reality. To achieve nuclear fusion, we faced down obstacles such as extreme temperatures and the containment of plasma, challenges that tested the limits of our technological capabilities. We've looked at the technology and research behind the creation of an artificial sun. The use of magnetic fields and plasma confinement were integral to this achievement, showcasing the brilliance of the human mind and its capacity for scientific discovery. We've celebrated the breakthrough in nuclear fusion that has led to the successful creation of an artificial sun in a controlled environment. This breakthrough is a testament to the power of perseverance and the relentless pursuit of knowledge. Finally, we've pondered the potential this achievement holds for solving energy crises and powering our future. The artificial sun could be the key to unlocking a future powered by limitless clean energy. In the grand scheme of things, this breakthrough is just the beginning. The journey of exploration and discovery continues, and we're excited to be part of it. Thank you for watching Time Pilgrimage. Remember to subscribe, like, and comment on our videos. If there's a topic you'd like us to explore, please let us know in the comments. Until next time, keep exploring.